Episode one, Awake, Before the Storm. Here we go. <clears throat> Recording for YouTube. Hello, hello, YouTube. 33% of the way to a level three hype train. Thanks to Food Bars 5 Gifted. The 100 bits from Cool Me and the gifted from Nightmare Crater, the 21 months from Nightmare Crater, and the 47 months from Gitsmo. Life is Strange Before the Storm is a game where Boston will be making all the wrong decisions for the next four days. That's a fact. Appreciate the hype train, guys. Everybody get in on the hype train if you uh, want some emotes. Yo, what's up, Wid? Welcome in. Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. Hell yeah. Fuck yes. I love me some Firewalk. Mom would kill me if she knew I was out here. Nah, she won't. She won't tell. She won't know, dude. She won't know, dude. Oh, thank you so much for letting me know there's a fence there. I appreciate it. Yo, y'all see my jumping skills? Let's go. Come on now. Holy shit. That's good jumping for being off for a week. This place is awesome. Yeah, it is. If I'm going to get inside, I'll have to get through that door. You can do it. It's fine. Firewalk is actually Kumi's native name. I had no idea. Kumi, why didn't you tell me that? All right, we don't. On fire. Ponder. Mom would totally flip her shit if she knew I hiked for an hour just to see a show. Oh, come on. We've hiked for an hour for worse, or less, rather. This place is sketchy as hell. An old abandoned building in the middle of nowhere, miles from home. Guys, thank you for the level two hype train. I appreciate y'all. <laughs> This RV's just begging for a little street art. But if I do it here, someone Enjoy will see. Show your emotes, guys. I don't have a feeling that getting in the door is gonna involve me like, wait a minute. Oh yeah. That's some firewalk right there, guys. This band shreds so hard. Cool me shreds so it. hard, let's get it. So if I look at it, what is the difference? A second door inside. So close, and yet so far. Why don't we just try to open it? Why won't it let me? Well, we're not getting into the kennel. Not this time. We did that last time. I'd join a motorcycle gang. If I had any friends. Me too. Let's go. What's up, dude? What's up? Yo, what's up, baby? Let me in. Shoo. You gotta let me in. Check it. I'm totally legit. Totally. Totally. Come on. It's not a bad fake, kid. But you're in over your head here. Do yourself a favor and scram. Look, I'm not scramming until I get me some cool me. I mean, firewalk. Can't push me around. Should I go back and stand up to him? An old lumber car. Guess it's been years since anyone's actually worked here. Punk ass. Who put you in charge, my dude? That saw looks ancient. I wonder how long ago the mill actually closed. How the heck do we get in? God, again? What do you want, kid? He 
Is that your bike over there? Yep. It's, uh, pretty cool. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Gee, thanks. Is that all? Yeah, um, do you want to be my tag team partner? This is the old mill, right? I heard Firewalk is playing here tonight. They're awesome. Nope. Did you say no? Nope? Kidding? You should probably just go. No. Absolutely not. I've started a back talk challenge. Oh no! What do I do? I have to convince this doorstop that I'm not giving up until he lets me inside. Yeah. Use arguments and insults to get someone to do what you want. Don't you remember what it's like to be a teenager? I just want to see the band. Yeah. I thought we went over this. Is it past your bedtime? It's not. It's not past my bedtime, actually. My bedtime is like 9 o'clock. Isn't it past yours? <laughs> Real cute. But I still don't know. That. I won that one! Let's go! Okay, let's go, let's go. Uh. Look at my face. Do I look cute? Or do I look like I'm going to kick your ass? Ooh, she mean business. <laughs> okay, kid. I get it. You're tough. I am not a damn kid. Other things I'm not. Young lady, kiddo, chica, sweet cakes. Babe. You, you? I can't protect what? you in there. I don't need your damn protection. You mean a girl who doesn't take shit from a walking pair of biceps like you? That kind of girl? My boss will kill me if I let you in. Bosses suck. Screw the man and fuck the rules, dude. Exactly. You're not accepting no for an answer. Of course not. No. Nope. nope. <laughs> and you really think you can take me? Hell yeah, yeah. Ken. What if I had a knife? I'll stick no my problem. fingers through None. your gauges. Don't care. What if I had? You could have a flamethrower, an army of robot ninjas, and a motherfucking dragon on a leash in there, and I'd still kick your ass. That's right, because I'm a gamer. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> You're all right, kid. Go on in. Yeah. You're right, I'm gonna go right in. Shoot. Ha ha! We won our first back talk stream! This is intense! Kick this oh, ass for one oh, All right, look. Back off! You dog. What's wrong with that deer head? Come on! You never won those as a kid, me either. I always get smacked across the mouth. Smack! Ow! 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 Just follow the lights and the sound. Can't wait to get in there and thrash. No, we're not petting the damn pit bull. What is wrong? All right, I'll try it. What's her name? Delia. She doesn't usually like people. Yeah. Me neither. <laughs> me neither. I love it, dude. Let's get it. All right, why are we in here again? Give me a shirt, my dude. No. Um, no, 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 no. Take. Look, we have... 20 bucks, baby. 20 bucks? That's robbery. And yeah. don't call me baby. That's right. Fine. 20 bucks, thief. That guy's a dick. If I want a shirt, I'm going to need to get creative. All right, so what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to do something to get $20. Yeah, so, so exactly as I'm to you. I'll write you Sketch Central. What's the knife? Sweet knife. Just like the one my mom refused to get me for my birthday. Uh-oh. Yeah,
That's actually a good idea, to be fair. I could use a beer. Drink more, feel less. Yes, please. What up, Frank? Oh, syringes? We don't wait. No, thanks. I try to avoid hepatitis, but I can't. Yeah, it's probably a very avoidable Yo, thing. Frank. Hey. Yo, Frank. Well, Baby. He... I know your name, you idiot. You bought pot for me every month for a year. Look at that get up. <laughs> Studs. You're trying too hard. What are you even doing here? I'm here to see Firewalk, man. They rock. How'd you even hear about this little firewalk? That's Colby's native How, name, remember? Internet. How else? Seriously? Fucking kids. <laughs> so, you come here a lot, or? Yeah. Right. It's cool. I'm really glad you approve. <laughs> okay, so, you holding? I could definitely use something to take the edge You just off. had a beer, what do you mean? As soon as you give me the 175 bucks you owe me. Shit. Do I really owe him that much? Unless I find some quick cash around here, I can kiss my high goodbye. Never mind, Ben. <sighs> Suit yourself. All right, so we need money and we need a t-shirt. Let's go. Reminds me of the way I make important life choices. What's up, Terry Love? Okay, good. That's exactly what we need. Thank Don't mess with Damon. Thanks for the memo. This place is mobbed. Okay, good. Sorry, dude. Maybe you shouldn't overcharge. We gonna get a Thanks shirt after playing. all, ain't we? Dick. Yeah, we getting a shirt, baby. Let's get it. Oh yeah, sweet, sweet victory. We we'll take the money too, baby. We we'll get us some joints. You know what I'm saying? Take it. That's like two hundred bucks. It's perfect. Grab it. Yes, we want it. No shit, if I have consequences, I still want it. Holy shit, I'm rich. Now we go give it to Frank. We pay off our debt. Right? That's how we do things. She returns. About that weed. That's right, baby. Uh, here it comes. I got the money now. Toss in a dime bag and we'll call it square. Hey, hey, what are you waving around this kind of money here for? You really don't think before you act, do you? Absolutely not, I don't think before nope. I act. So, where's my pot? Yeah, where's my pot? No more loans. I'm not your fucking piggy bank. You're a good man, Frank. No. I'm not. Now beat it, Price. You're cramping my style. Wow, then. So, should we I'll go upstairs? Try upstairs Whatever. first? Or should we go see Kumi on the stage? Oh, it's Half broken. those stairs are rotted through. Looks nice. Like hey, Corn, thank you for the 53 months. So, resubbery, I appreciate it. Even my wife comes in my stream sometimes. Let's go. Because I'm the best! Alright, I see that I still have a hair. 
Can you take another beer? I want another beer. Can I have another beer? Hello? Can I have a beer? No? Okay. Here we go. Give two flying shits who you are. No. And I give zero shits. Exactly right, Chloe. You know Good job. Out for you, bitch. Hey, you know what? All right. Mosh pit is a no go. Fine. No, we want a mosh pit. Maybe I can get a better view of the action from up above. We already tried that. What do you mean, new dialogue? Ooh, what's this? Uh oh. Guys, I'm. I, I'm. I'm. Okay. Hey, have you seen that game, Small Land? It's your kind of game, very fun. Yeah, I have seen it. I just have no money right now, dude. I, I'm very interested in it. But money and time are issues I don't have, uh, two things I don't have a whole lot of right now. Whew! All right, I don't know why I couldn't go upstairs before. Made it. I can't believe it. We're the best. <laughs> Copyrighted by YouTube. Thank you very much for the song. Life is strange. Yeah, it looks really good, Chris. Should I apologize? I feel like if I don't apologize, he's gonna get a little mad at me. Then how about I show you how unimpressed I am with limp dick assholes who get butt hurt over a spilled beer? I think she's calling us out, dude. She's gonna regret every word. Every word. Oh, this is gonna be good. I'm gonna teach this little punk some man. I'm serious. You wanna see me get angry here? Because I'm getting there. And it won't be pretty. It won't. She thinks she can take you? Hey! Dickhead! Attack or run? Hmm. I must choose carefully. Hmm. I think we shall attack. Rachel? Come on. Hurry up. I'm gonna finish this for you so that it gets a lot of stuff that came in. I'm so smart that I bought pot.
Let's go. We saw Colby in concert. Yeah, you are pretty much the best. I agree. I agree. You are. You are. Oh, this camera's gonna bug the crap out of me all day, dude. It's true. Did you try to deactivate and reactivate? I have not. Yeah, it's still doing it. You should never try to light something when you're laying down in bed like that. You'll get your beard on fire. Speak from experience. It's true, it's true. Been there, done that. Good plan. Daily rituals are important. Even when they involve in unread letters to friends who So is this like a it is, okay. All right. Well, Boston, I have finally don't it. I don't know what you don't it, but I hope you don't it easily or or I hope you didn't don't it too much. Another day in paradise. Right? Oh my god, my ex-wife used to say that shit. Last night. I don't it all the time, me too. What have you finally done, Crater? It was. It was Rachel Amber. Yep, it was. I remember her. Um. Um, here we go. She got like a, She got like a shiner, dude. Alright, switch the music off. Wake and bake is part of a healthy breakfast. Damn straight. Ask Miss Arcadia. Wait, what? Who? What photo? <sighs> I have feelings about this. Most of them are not good feelings. I ordered me a capture card and stream deck and a few other things I needed to get my stream rig going. Nice. You don't need a stream deck. Stream deck's a waste of money. I wish I had not bought mine. It doesn't even work half the time, to be honest. That really was Rachel Amber. And she saved my life. Yeah, I should sell mine too. That's a good idea, actually. How much did you get for yours, um, call me? I hate fucking rainbows. 
I'm gonna keep it real. Max made me this mix CD years ago. And because it was Max, not a single song was pirated. This <laughs> is so stupid. Yeah, I have the same one, yeah. Yeah, we can get dressed, what the hell. Which one should we wear? I like this one over here, the firewalk one, yeah. People want them, so I'd sell it if you don't use it. Yeah, I don't know where I would sell it, though. It just sits here, dude. Like I said, most of the time it doesn't even work. Alright, we'll go downstairs now. I don't know. It's not you. How drunk was I last night? You were pretty shit faced if I remember correctly, which I don't. Guess I better try calling my phone with the moms. It's a solid idea. Okay. Mom's phone is probably in her room. I can use it to call mine, then figure out who the hell I left. Mom's old engagement ring. Supposed to be mine if I'm ever stupid enough to get married. Why would you leave her phone in here, dude? Like, what? How can mom look at this every day and not see what a troll she's doing? He's not a troll. He's actually a nice guy that's misunderstood. Did you not see the prequel, the sequel of this game that was actually happened before but is actually after? No? Fine. In the bathroom. There we go. Wonder how many calls I do. I'm a dope. I remember why she got a shiner. Duh. Uh oh. Messages. Uh oh. Consequences. Uh oh. The hell is this guy? I don't know who you are, Elliot, but we'll find out. Why is there only one T in your name, my dude? Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, we'll get your purse, because I'm... I did not see her purse, because I was looking for my damn phone. Stupid head. Ouch. Ouch. We sh guys, we shouldn't have opened that drawer. That was a bad call. Get off me, fly! This is not your show. Does it say the fly show? No, it doesn't. Oh, my gosh. Should I grab your condoms too, Mom? Huh? Should I? I don't think so. Okay, here we go, here we go. Wow. Her accent is faker than somebody's boobs that I know. All right, dining table. Oh, hold on. No, I don't want to look at that. I looked at that at the last game. Why would I look at that this game, too? That's ridiculous. What? You better watch your mouth, Ma. Okay. So, yeah, she's going to stroke out if we don't find out, that's for sure. 
Can I put some that's travel money? There's nothing. Yeah. Dad's old swear jar. He spent the last of his curses on the bus fare and milk. Wow, that's messed up. Milk, really? Hey, Mom. Do you want it to talk? Holly, what happened to you? It's no big deal. I walked into a door. You seem to be walking into a lot of things. Um, I'll send you a text message, Chloe, like last night. I need you to answer. No, I will not. Say text. You don't have to say message. And I need you to answer. Wow, okay. <clears throat> I was sleeping. I didn't get your text until just now. Yes, right the second. Is that what you want to talk about? Can we talk about the fake southern accent, maybe? And the fact that her hair clip doesn't match her shirt? Huh? Can we? Um, I didn't hear what she said. Damn it. Um, school. <laughs> Hi, baby. You see our camera? It's all underwater. -ish. See? <laughs> what did she say, David? All right. You do realize I hate my boyfriend with every fiber of my being, right? Chloe. So I'm curious if the fiber of my being makes me poop more. He's a dickhole. <laughs> Yeah, you'll grab Rachel's. Mm. Oh, you'll enjoy this. The other day I made four eggs, two for David, two for me. And just before I served them, he says, what are you mm. going to eat? I'll enjoy that, huh? Firewall? Is that the band you mentioned last week? I'm still bummed you wouldn't let me go. Mm-hmm. Mm. What? Check, please. Probably not. Sick, just so you don't get it hey, come on now. Somebody has to take a take one for the team. I do know what is she a waitress? Yes. Why is she wearing heels? Because she's an idiot. Your and your Wait, At least her heels match her hair thingamajig, I guess. Mm -hmm. Are you going to bed? Soon. Wow. Wow. Surrounded by old people. Early? What? I have phone calls and stuff I have to get done before noon. Before everybody goes off to lunch. Okay. What phone calls? Uh, I got to call the pharmacy and find out why my medicines aren't getting refilled. And then you call the Maybe David not, should start paying rent. Whoever's at fault for that. that. Yeah, mine got refilled. Finally. You never hear I have one. I know. I'm out of like three. Including my diabetes David medicine. should mind his own business. So I have to find out what's going on there and how I get that. He's a good man. So I have to follow that path. Um, and find out if the new pain management doctor takes the insurance. Okay. Try to see if Your boyfriend's an asshole. He's been good for me. Maybe he I wish I knew what was wrong with my cam. He's still so breathing. He's not getting off the couch. That means I've been more than I want to test your online version of that. He's probably leaving tomorrow. Love you. Bullshit. Mom's That's what. I guess. Maybe I should too. But what's the point in getting along if it means pretending everything's fine when it's not? Mm. Mom, I know you're dealing with a lot. Thank you. I understand you don't need me as much anymore. But I need you. I do still need you. You're my mom. I'm proud of you for being so self-sufficient. Yeah, they are. Right? <laughs> wow.
tries to give me advice, or looks at me funny, Chloe, or looks at me at all. Chloe. Mom. Have a good day. You too. Bringing David his keys is about the most humiliating thing Mom could ask me to do. Where are the keys? Did she already give them to me? Okay, damn it. Where are they? We're already supporting one. Thanks. <laughs> damn. That's and dirty, yo. Oh my gosh. I don't remember which one. It's fine. I got your back. All right, we're not going to look at that. Where do we go now? Unsorted mail? Trash? No. We don't go out that door. Hmm. So this is about five months... If I remember correctly, it's about five months before the other game. Because the other one was in October, right? Pretty sure. What a piece of crap. No, it's not. Oh, okay. The car is not a piece of crap. My man's got a square head, dude. Quality time. Better just get the socket wrench and fit this over with. What's David doing? Leaving stuff in our garage anyway. Does he think he's moving in or something? He is. I don't want to tell you what's going to happen, but it's true. Chance I smash him in the face with this. <laughs> 60 40. Maybe 90 10. <laughs> I like controlling her more than Max so far. That's what she said. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It would have actually. It could have. It could have. See what's going to get up the works there? That's a sign. Carbon deposit. 
saw this? Oh shit. No, you could actually be good at this. If you lost the attitude. My attitude is what makes me special, <sighs> David. Very fair. We had a moment, call me. I think we had a moment. Shut this down, my dude. Respect him. I think it's time I show this asshole I'm not interested in anything he has to say. Let's do it. What's clear is fuck you. Language. Way out of line, you lady. Language? Shema Paul don't give a shit. Let's go! Um I doubt it. Oh, that's what I smell. A giant load of crap. You your mother. At least she has a heart. All you have is <laughs> what's it called when you've got one porn stash and zero game? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, dude. Oh You're shit. On the same planet as my father. My job is to make sure you and your mother have a safe oh, no. peaceful home. That was the wrong thing. If your job is to fuck up my life, then someone should give you a raise. <laughs> Let's go. Solid usage of the F word, Chloe. Cool. If you were a man, I wouldn't go so easy on you either. Wow. Me either. Just stop. Mission accomplished. This game is great. <laughs> this is a much better ability than reverse in time. I like this. I could get used to the insulting. We're making all the right decisions so far, stream. Jerkwad, I love it. Oh, I love it! I guess mom left her purse back here. What is happening? Is she dreaming? Oh, no, not that! That 
It's the worst thing that could happen in a dream. Yes, definitely dreaming. It's going to be fine, even though her dad really did die that way. It's okay. She could dream about it. It's okay. That car's not bad, dude. She's overreacting. The car's oh, kind of dope. Cow. Chloe's dope. I love her character. She's really good. She's just a typical teenage girl, man. Oh, that's broken, you know? Elliot? Wait, what happened to your face? Do you need to go to the nurse or something? What? This? You should see the other guy. Yes, it's true, then. I heard you had a hell of a night. I mean, people are talking about it. People can eat a dick. Even social <laughs> Oh, this is not working. Yeah, okay. Totally. I know it's gonna be lame, but I was thinking, do you want to go together tomorrow? I try to make it a rule not to go to school any more than I have to. Sitting in the back row and making fun of the drama kids might not suck. Right? That's totally what I was thinking. Alright. See you in Cam. Yeah. For sure. Oh my god. Okay. So I had Toby take this controller apart and now it's not. Is that. Is it. It is charging, right? That's what that means. Oh. Hold on. Yeah, it is. Alright, good. Yes. Perfect. Okay, it's working. That scared me. Um, I don't know. I'm assuming this is the original fur furry. Get DVD from stuff. What's transcoding mean? Transcoding is the ability to change the quality of a stream from 1080 to 720 to 480 as a viewer. If you can't do that, then a streamer does not have transcoding. Um, she's right in front of you. Probably should have said that before I got over here. So it makes it so people with bad internet furry can um, lower the quality of the stream so they can still watch it without buffering. Sweet. Five bucks, right? Keep it. I'm just glad someone here appreciates the classics. You even asked for the director's cut, which took out the shitty voiceover and replaced it with a sweet dream sequence. Dream life over real life. That's my motto. <laughs> no, it isn't. That's not your motto. Get out of here. Rachel Amber, you're asking me? Didn't you two go out last 
night or was it just like a friend thing? Okay, that's between me and Rachel, okay? Why do you want to know? Yeah, why? <laughs> Steph has a crush. Chloe, you should join her game. Um, no. Yeah, I don't have 50 hours. You know what I'm going to do? What's up, girl? What is up? At the end of the campaign, so it'll only take like 20 minutes. What else have you got to do before class? Um, I don't know. Good question. Um, sure. What the hell? Game on, nerds. <sighs> wow. Here's a character sheet. You are an elf barbarian. <laughs> Mama do it's going well. I'm an elf barbarian, as you can see. Nice. I could totally see myself as an elf barbarian. Same. Just change the ear, the ears. All right. Let's get started. You are both famous heroes in the kingdom of Avalon, a once peaceful land, now laid to waste by the bloodthirsty raiders of Black Well. Alone, you have fought your way through the raider camps, seeking their warlord leader, Durgaron. As you Ooh. enter the final camp, bloodied and weary, you see your fellow hero approaching from the opposite <sighs> direction. Ooh. I raise my staff to you and greet you. I am Elamon, wizard of the Third Circle, foremost advisor to King Tiberius, and sworn defender of Avalon. I don't know this game, so it's a, you, d you make decisions along the way and it changes the way the story goes. Um, it's pretty fun. I played the first one, and this is the prequel to that one. Introduce your character. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm an elf barbarian named, uh... My name is Kalamasia Barb. Barb. No, 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 no. Step. Hey, give Barb a chance. Yes, okay. give Barb a chance. That's a hashtag. Hashtag give Barb a chance. Boobies. Um. <sighs> stabbed a guy in the chest with a sword, and it went all the way through and killed the guy behind him too. True story. <laughs> to your left, the raiders' training ground. To your right, their prison camp. Straight ahead, an enormous, ostentatious tent that could only belong to Durgaron, the Unscarred. Which way do you go? Straight ahead, right? We're supposed to kill the Dur dude. Elamon frowns. The Raiders can have some good loot at the training ground, and surely it is our duty to free all those prisoners. Your choice, newbie. Hmm. Where do you wish to go? I want to go to the Warlord's Tent. Are you sure you want to skip the training ground and the prison camp? Yep. Yep. You enter the tent to I'm a gamer. I don't do tutorials. <laughs> we don't need to know how to play the game to beat the boss. Turn it up a little? Okay. What'll it be? I turned it down earlier because of the music was really loud. What's Wrathful Rush? It's like a shoulder slam, an angry, angry shoulder slam. Okay, I do that. You scream with wrathful rage, then charge. Durgaron is caught off guard, and he fails to dodge. You slam your shoulder into him, knocking him back and doing some damage. Hell yeah. So we didn't need no Next. stake in training ground. Get out of here with that madness. Oh, holy shit. Uh, annihilation strike. 
That sounds boss as fuck. One? Thank That's you, Fubar. That's bad, right? Not for me. As you take your first step, you trip on a rock, collapsing onto the ground in a clangy jumble of metal. Your axe swings wildly to the side. Mikey, roll a reflex save. Oh, no. Three. Your axe strikes Elamon's leg. Um, legs. Plural. Severing both feet at the ankles. This game is awesome. My yep. feet? Uh, Durgeron moves toward the crippled Elmon. <laughs> oh, shit. I told you this was my best boss. You didn't tell me my character might die. Durgeron approaches, stomping his bloody hooves. Stomp. 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 This is all my fault. Sort of. What should I... Hmm... I jump in front of Elamon. Wow. Thanks, Chloe. I mean, thanks, Barb. Okay. Durgeron has I need his shirt. It says cool story, bro. He charges, thrusting madly with his great sword. Shit! Oh, no. Your attempt to dodge his thrust fails. Durgeron laughs as he impales you on his blade, lifting you high into the air. Seriously? I can't do anything with that stupid bracer. I'm sorry, Chloe. Hey, I chopped your feet off. We're even. You feel your strength draining away as Durgeron lifts you higher into the air. It hurts like hell. What do you do? Um... Swing for his I arm. Bring my axe down onto his arm. The yeah. one with the fire bracer thingy. Oh, brilliant. You'll have to roll high to hit. You're almost dead. Twice. Let's go! Fuck yes! You bring your axe down in a wicked chop, severing his arm completely. His bracer of fire immunity clings to the ground. I cast Gignomi's Fire Strike of Flame. Oh, snap! Lying on the ground, you conjure a flaming spear, which flies from your hands to spear Durgeron in the chest, incinerating him completely from the inside out. Damn, Elamon. Durgeron is defeated, but your wounds were too great. I'm afraid Barb is dead. I actually feel sad right now. <laughs> Better to have died a hero than live as a coward. Very fair. That was fun. Check out what I drew. Mikey's got serious drawing skills. What? No, he doesn't. Get out of here. Glad you enjoyed it, Chloe. Yeah. I'll adventure with you anytime. Are you flirting with me? Thanks for the game, nerds. Yeah, Beauty? nerds. Check. Next stop, chemistry class. Joy. We're killing it. This is so much easier than a game with a ton of zombies in it. We're trying to deal with DC on the battlegrounds. What the um, excuse me, more civil play. What have you got here, Twitch? Don't call me that. True North. A jock so dumb he makes jocks look bad. I guess Nathan Prescott made the shit list. Oh my god, oh, it's wow. him. This is some really weird crap, Prescott. It's not yours. Give it back. I hate that you're on the team now. You're such a loser. Guys, no need to fight. You can both be losers. The mute speaks? Whoa, whoa. You earn a spot on the squad, Twitch. You don't have your dad try to buy off the coach. At least my family pays tuition. How much financial aid does your deadbeat dad need again? Wow. Dick move, Nathan. <laughs> my dad <laughs> lost his job at the shipyard when your dad closed it down. And you want to talk shit to me? Leave Nathan alone. Hey. Uh, you know huh? something, Prescott? I'm going to do okay. you a favor. Be safe. You can't be a part of the team and be into this stupid crap at the same time. Okay. 
You're a piece of shit. I am going stop to it. kill you. You guys, stop! Chloe, do something! Don't just stand there watching! Um, 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 I don't like him! I'm staying out of this one! Hey, if you don't take the time to stand back and watch, you miss some of life's finer moments. Like... Booyah! That. <laughs> that took me months to put together. Quit the team, Twitch. Or next time it'll be worse. Go to hell. You should be ashamed. No, no, I shouldn't. What do you mean? Chemistry class, right? Yeah. Rachel! Hi! Oh, good. You're here. I do beseech you, chiefly that I might set it in my prayers. What is your name? Miranda. Oh, my father, I have broke your hest to say so. Good. Admired Miranda. Indeed worth what's dearest in the world. Many a lady I have eyed with best regard, and many a time have listened to... Many a time, the harmony of their tongues... Hath I listened to... Hayden, you're killing me. You've had weeks to be off book. Yes, Sorry, weeks! No, Horrible. don't apologize to me. Apologize to your scene partner who's been very accommodating and to your other fellow actors and most of all to yourself Mr. It's one short. Sorry to interrupt, but does this look better? I had my mom take it in a bit Rachel looks awesome This is getting as surreal as last night Looking good Rach. Very cool exquisite Rachel as always Mr. Keaton. I'm still having trouble with my affections are then most humble. I have no ambition to see a goodlier man. I mean, does she really mean that? Especially because I just straight out told her I've been banging all the ladies. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, that is hard. We've talked about that line forever. We need a fresh perspective. No, we don't. The question is, are Miranda's feelings of instant passion for Ferdinand just inexperience in dramatic circumstances, or... Has she actually just met the love of her life? What do you think? Um, I think Miranda's an idiot. Miranda's an idiot because falling in love is stupid. What is she, 12? Actually, she's about 15. So your point, whoever you are, about being an idiot or being naive is well taken. Thank you very much. Thanks, Mr. I Keaton. thought of it myself. Later. See you later, guys. Oh, no. Actually, I just clicked I the square button. improv with a class full of freshmen now. I don't Rachel go into black. Well, what do you mean, call me? Fabulous. I don't remember. Oh, okay. Uh, what? <laughs> just kidding. That asshole really clocked you. It so don't forget, this is before the first game, though. I'll just be so if you didn't play this, you might not okay. know that. Do you so, know what I mean? Why am I here again? Oh, could you grab my belt for me? I think it's in my bag over there. Uh, y yeah. Sure. <sighs> okay. Uh, get the belt. Don't say any stupid shit, and don't, like... Fall down. She said it she was in the bag, it. right? Wait. She said there was a bag somewhere? I see it. Rachel looks so happy here.
There's Rachel's belt. Guess I'll go give this to Rachel now. Why would Rachel? I don't understand. What? What is happening? What is with this? Is it okay? So it's not letting me out. I don't know what's going on. Okay, maybe she went back here then? No? Hello? Hello? Less talk, more belt. Rachel, is this your belt? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. I really like your costume. Thanks. So? Did you bring flowers for my dressing room? The fuck? Uh, how about a belt instead? Perfect. I'll let you finish changing now. What? No way. Chloe Price. Rachel Amber. Last night was amazing. I, I, I'd never seen Firewalk live. Pretty fierce show. We'll have to do it again. To tell the truth, I went to bed last night wishing it never had to end. But then I thought, why? Why does it have to end? Good questions. Maybe it doesn't have to end. Exactly. How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Hmm. <laughs> Ditch class. You mean it? Is that weird? No, it's awesome. I hoped you'd say that. Know about that eye? That is a hell of a battle scar. Do you want me to cover it up with some makeup? No. Are you kidding? This is a badge of honor. Damn straight. I agree. Respect. Let's get the hell out of here. Mm, we're ditching school. We're going on a field trip. Sure you don't want to just grab the bus or nope if we're gonna go rogue we're doing it right well what the hell am i getting into here who cares just have fun where does this thing go on the rails what? Maybe we'll end up in Seattle. Pull up a chair, Price. The view's amazing. Oh my god, that's cool. Rachel wants me to pull up a chair. Maybe one of these crates. <laughs> Whoa, Nathan's dad is a Terminator? That totally checks out. 
I feel Poor pretty Elliot. confident there's going to be a dead body in here. <laughs> there's no dead body in there. Get the hell out of here, dude. Guess we're not the first ones to hop on this train. I wonder what the symbols mean. Does it really matter? I mean, come on. Things heavier than it looks. I guess I should sit down. All right, Chloe, you're on a freaking train with Rachel freaking Amber. Play it cool. I is this nervousness? Nope. Is that what this feeling is? It's not. I wish Max were here so I could ask. Should I make small talk? Is that what people do? Nope. Just sit there and stare at her while you faint. Nice weather. Um, no. Uh, <laughs> so, um, what is wrong with you? What? You're acting nervous. Yep. Nope, nope, so, nope, 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 kind of nope, 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 nope. I don't hang out with anyone and I don't have any friends. You have friends. Well, I used to. Friend. Singular. Her name was Max, but she left for greener, more northern pastures. That sucks. Um. I didn't mention it earlier, but you seem to have some kind of Jedi mind powers over Mr. Keaton and the theater crew. You mean when we were talking about true love in the play? <laughs> I guess you could say I'm good with people, yeah. Just don't pull that stuff with me. You will get on this train. Oh, shit. <laughs> I bet you're wondering what we're doing. The um, thought occurred, yeah. Well... I wanted some company. That's it? That's it. Yeah. Good to fucking go. Anything beats another second in Blackwell. You really hate it there, don't you? I sure do. You don't? <laughs> right. What reason would Rachel Amber have for hating Blackwell Academy? Your high school royalty. You don't know me. Yet. Let's do something fun. Mm. V card's been punched, Rachel. I'm sorry. Wow. Too far. Well, I don't know. Okay, something fun. I'm all ears. Two truths and a lie. Oh shit, not this what? game. I think we should play Two Truths and a Lie. It's a game where each person offers up three facts about themselves, two of which are the truth, and one of which is a lie. Right. And then the other person has to guess which is which. Hmm, okay, okay. Sounds fun. You're on. I'll start. First, I'm ambidextrous. Second, I was born in New York, the land of fashion and Broadway, to which I will one day return when my heinous exile here in Arcadia Bay comes to an end. Lies. New York, huh? I've never been. Not a world traveler? Not yet, at least. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? Russia, Greece, Kathmandu? Nope. Kathmandu? I would go to the pizza restaurant. One day, I'm going to climb Everest. So am I. Are you from New York and the land of Broadway, Fubar? Is ambitious. What's your third thing? My third thing? Two truths and a lie. You say three things. Right. I'm a Leo. Meow. Okay. <laughs> so, ambidextrous, born in New York, and a Leo. Gotcha. So, which is the lie? Which one is the lie, you guys? Which one do you think is the lie? I think she's, um... I think she's not ambidextrous. That's what I think. I don't think she's ambidextrous. 
Ambidextrous means that she, both of her hands are dominant. Like, you know how I'm right-handed, other people can be left-handed? An ambidextrous person means that both arms are dominant. They can do everything with either one. I don't buy the ambidextrous claim. No? Well, that's too bad, because it's true. <sighs> Prove it. Sign your name with both hands. Sign where? Seriously? All the bad girls do it. Come on. Damn. She cheated! The lie was New York. I'm a Cali girl, born and raised. She's so got aimbot! On the bucket list. Broadway, here I come. Aimbot, cool. aimbot, aimbot! Okay, your turn, Price. First fact. Right. Something about myself. Should I start things off with a lie or with the truth? Or should I cheat? Let's see how good she really is at this game. Yes, let's find out. Um, let's go with the truth first. Um. I used to love country music when I was a kid. Now it makes me want to throw up. Literally. That's weird. And then we'll do the truth again. I love science. Seriously, I think Neil deGrasse Tyson is the shit. Me too, me too, me huh. too, me too. Me too. And then, and then the lie. Sad to say this, since you're a Leo and all, but I'm allergic to cats. Yep, allergic to pussy. You? Yep, allergic to pussy. You're hella mysterious, Chloe Price. Uh, hella? <laughs> Who says that? It's a Cali thing. Anyway, I think I have your number. I'm not sure why country music makes you throw up. I'm a complex girl, Rachel. And I think it's probably true. Also, I kinda like the Dixie Chicks. Uh-oh, they're not gonna work out. You and David both. No accounting for taste. I think one or both of them is going to end up dead. God damn it. God damn it. He's just some asshole. Who likes the Dixie Chicks? He's an asshole my mom's dating, <laughs> I guess. And you don't like him. <laughs> it's still so weird that she's dating someone. My dad and my mom, <laughs> they were totally in love. You can tell how fucked up she is now just by how she's settling for David. He's this total hard-ass ex-military jagoff type. Like, the opposite of my dad. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, David has no respect. He acts like I'm some kind of problem to solve. Sometimes I am a problem, though. That's a load of bullshit. What do you mean? You're not a problem, Chloe. You're a person. It sounds like the only problem is David. You need to hit him where it hurts. <laughs> the only thing that David loves has four wheels and a four-barrel carburetor. <laughs> oh, God. A muscle car? I'm probably going to steal it soon, so... Let me know if you need an accomplice. <laughs> Okay, you say you love science, but you are failing chemistry. You're saying failing chemistry means I hate science? Or that Blackwell doesn't inspire your best work. <clears throat> that place is a hellhole filled with shit where Agreed. shitty people go to be shitty to each other and themselves. Absolutely. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, though. Anyway, school sucks, but you love science. I'm gonna say true. Which brings me to your alleged cat allergy. Alleged? I'm calling lie. Why is that? I mean, maybe you're allergic, but I've passed by your locker a few times, and I've seen that old photo of a cat. She be stalking your girl. 
right? You've passed by my locker? Stalker much? Hey, I notice things. I can't help it. I guess you're no stranger to being noticed, too. It's kind of new for me. Well, get used to it. So, if my math is correct, you told me two truths and one lie. What? You expected me to cheat? Winners make their own rules, Chloe. You are crazy good at this game. Right? A lifetime of studying the human condition. Well, I'm impressed. I bet it's hard to impress Chloe Price. I'm gonna feel good about that one. When your dad is the district attorney, I guess lying is something you're used to. What? Seriously? Really? Seriously. I know who to call if I need to get out of a ticket, though. Right? Not that I have a right of my own. Why did we not know Car about first, this in the second game? Embarrassing number of moving violations, second. Or the first game. Hey. Thanks for trusting me. Trusting you? You played the game. Also, you told me about that dickwad David. Now he's on my shit list too. Hell yeah. Mustache brain won't know what hit him. I guess. Fubar wouldn't bail you out. He knows what's That's better it. for you. It's not a big deal. Hate to break it to you, but Chloe Price is not exactly renowned throughout Arcadia Bay as a bastion of trust and empathy. Yes, she is. Trust doesn't exactly come easy to me. Maybe if you'd had my life, you'd understand. Right? No, I get that. Yep, on the too. other hand, I got on this train with you, didn't I? Fair point. Wouldn't mind listening to some music. Hey, want to listen? She don't like my music. Cool bracelet. I've had it, I guess, since I was a kid in Long Beach. It reminds me that there's more to experience out there than just Arcadia Bay. Maybe one day I'll go back to Long Beach. Or anywhere but here. Maybe sooner than later. What brought that on? Sometimes, I feel like I've got no reason to stay. Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day, I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Check it out! We're here! What? Where is here? Jump and find out! Did you say jump? Jump! Fuck it! Fuck it! <laughs> what a response, dude. Like, what? <laughs> oh, man.
That's a cool place. Hey, it's actually a pretty nice view. Glad you approve. And as your reward for making it up here, I have a new game for us to play. I know oh, yeah? one. I like games. Deal with it. This is one I learned in theater class. It's all about improvisation. So far, what I've learned about you is that you're into acting, lying, and playing games. What's your point? That you're either full of imagination or full of shit. Hmm. Let me know when you figure out which one. I will. I will. This game involves spying on people from afar. Luckily, we've got some high-tech surveillance equipment right here. Let's fire it up. Damn, that didn't go well. Very predictable, though. That blows. Well, shit. That was my last quarter. You? Quarterless. Damn. Hey, maybe I can MacGyver something up. I've been told I'm pretty handy. Oh, yeah? How are we gonna MacGyver up a quarter? Let's see what you got. All right, I'm interested. Rachel really wants to use this viewfinder. I'd love to get it working for her. Oh, my God, no. We're not gonna, we're not, we're just, okay? This whole day is out of order but in the best possible way. Huh. Looks like I might be able to pry it open with the right tool. Cool me is the right tool. Dwight Mueller really killed it with this statue of an explorer guy. Where are all my explorer ladies at, though? Probably at home, washing laundry and spitting out kids. Fuck. This blackwall guy sure liked founding stuff that was already there. Founders <laughs> keepers, I guess. <laughs> founding stuff that was already there. That shit's hilarious, dude. If Max were here, she'd probably take a black and white photograph and call it Innocence Lost or some shit. Get out of here, woodland creatures. Have some self-respect. What? Woodland creatures? We don't say that. That's stupid. Is there a tool there now? Bye, you fools. What the heck? They keep coming back! Get out of here, woodland creatures. Have some self-respect. Get out the... the what? This trash can is in pretty high demand. Right? I wonder if I could use this to get the quarter out. I wonder if I could use this to get the quarter out. Yeah, we could. We could figure out how to get that off. What are these people? Oh. Yuck. Cliche much, A.W. and O. Maybe. I've been saying sorry all morning. I admit it was really dumb to lock the keys in the car. You've been on me for three hours. Doesn't look like she's on you. Hey, spare some change? Sorry. We might have some leftover food when we're done. What? No, I'm not. What kind of food? <laughs> This is really going downhill. Let's Shh. go. She's right there. Damn, son, where'd you find this? 
Exactly, exactly. I agree. You want to steal their wine? Yeah. My hierarchy of Yo. needs goes pot, then beer, then wine. Still, so what? wino has a classy ring to it. Whoa, that's badass. Yep, it's official. I'm learning way more ditching school than I ever do in class. What's worse than groveling for change? Groveling for change and failing. Fair enough, fair enough. Hmm. It's gonna be up this way then, right? No? I don't want to head down there just yet. All right, so it's not down that way either. Interesting. Don't axe, don't fell. Let's go trophy time. I'm the best. It's true. All right. That was the best I would have found my girlfriend, um, prospective girlfriend. Wonder if I can get that quarter out of the viewfinder. Wait, is that the same AW as before? Not afraid of commitment, I see. Yeah, definitely not. Um Bye, you fools. I'm not sure what to do. Yeah, the squirrels come back, the little shits. Huh. Let's go back and talk to her and tell her that we're a failure. Uh, I'm thinking about prying open that viewfinder. Got a knife on you? A knife? Yeah. My mom took mine. Uh, no. How about a nail file? A nail file would work, probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess you could stab someone with a nail file. <sighs> oh, right. Sh sure, let's try it. Victoria, you're so stupid. Damn it. It always looks so easy in the movies. Okay. I wonder if I can find some So we're going to use the nail file to take the thing off the bench, and then the thing off the bench will be what I use to pry that open. It makes sense now, okay? Wow, just tosses her nail file away like she's not gonna need it again. She's gonna Stealing need that a dedication again. Dedication plate takes persistence. She's <laughs> gonna need that nail file again. If she asked for it, we're in deep doo doo.
Doing my best to make everybody around me happy. First got power, activate. I don't want to boast, so I'll let you do it for me. <laughs> Chloe Price, you are truly the viewfinder whisperer. That's true. It's I stand true. in all of your powers. Rachel smells like Jasmine. Is she smelling me right now, too? Really should have showered this morning. All right, here's the game. You find some people for us to spy on, and then you and I will act out what they're saying and thinking. That's it? I do that in my head during, like, every class. <laughs> right? See? You're a natural. Let's give it a try. All right. Um, that's just one person. Think this guy's married to a nutritionist? He's all like, I'm not allowed to eat this stuff at home. So <laughs> I love Greece. How can something that tastes so good be so wrong? Oh, dropped a fry on my suit. <laughs> now I'll have to burn it. Good thing I have a giant squirrel costume in the car. <laughs> <laughs> They totally stole my third grade art project. Wow, you made that? Can't you tell? It does have a certain give zero fucks quality. That Let's go, it sure does. Hey, what do you say we barbecue some squirrels when we're done here? God, you just have the best ideas. Thank you, I do the best I can. Why wouldn't let me do her? Hmm. What's going on with these two? And the Lord said it, thou shalt make a burnt offering of your firstborn son. Who are you talking to, Dad? No one, son. Now, lean into the grill and see if the fire started. Further. <laughs> Further. Wow. That was dark. Too dark? Perfect dark. Loving this guy. What's he thinking right now? <laughs> no matter how fast I go, I'll never outwalk this wedgie. <laughs> That's so tragic, but also beautiful in its own way. <laughs> <sighs> this is fun. Who's next? Oh, 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 go back. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to hog the viewfinder. I bet you that's her parents or something. Or her dad. Ooh, jackpot. Commence makeout session in three, two, one. Nailed it. Damn, they are really going at it. Oh, honey. I think we used the vibrating bed for too long. <laughs> I'm totally seeing double. <laughs> Rachel? Hey, are you all right? Guaranteed that's her dad. Excuse me? Last I checked, you're supposed to be Chloe Price. Yet we've been ditching now for hours, and we haven't even gotten wasted yet. That's 
got to be against some school ditching rule. Wow. Uh, hell yeah. The honor student wants to show the school delinquent how to party? Be my guest. How gracious of you. Mood disorders much? They have a bottle of wine. Let's steal it. Uh, okay. Or we could go try to find a liquor store instead. No. You shouldn't bring alcohol to a public park if you're not willing to share it with everybody, right? And Fair point. Fuck it. I just want to take something that's not mine. All right. I'm going in. Try to keep up. Damn. Um, can we help you? <sighs> oh my god! <laughs> really? Holy shit! <laughs> Talk about committing to a performance. What a badass. Better act fast. Oh, thank god. Please, this girl is in trouble. Go get help. Um, yeah. I need to get these two to focus on Rachel so I can swipe the wine. What are you waiting for? Go! Don't look at me. Look at Baywatch over here. Aw, uh, I don't remember how to do CPR. What? <laughs> it's time to nut up or shut up. Yes, it is. Watch out. I'm going to check her pulse. That's... On her neck, right? Yes. I still think you should go get help. There's a ranger station on the other side of the park. Good point. We'll keep watch while you go. Uh, uh, look at all the time we've wasted already. This woman needs mouth-to-mouth -mouth resuscitation. Stat. Uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Definitely needs mouth to mouth. This is great. Okay, okay, <laughs> you can do this. I can't do it. Pathetic. Oh, God. Look, he's clearly useless. <laughs> this woman needs help from someone who actually knows what they're doing. Hey, look at me. Do you want to be locked out of the car of life forever, or are you ready to break in there and seize the keys to your potential? Oh my God. You're right. Hey, wow. I'm all better now. You saved my life from the bottom of my heart. Oh my gosh. Yeah, good work everyone. Peace out. That was incredible. You're a hero. Huh. I guess I am. Oh my gosh, no. Damn. Here, you earn this. Thanks. <laughs> could use a drink after trying to keep up with you. I am excessively sober right now. Right? Right. Okay. Guess we're leaving now. I always like the music in these games, man. But I kind of see what they're doing. They're trying to make you, like, understand where, what Rachel, I mean, what Chloe was doing. 
and how she met Rachel and started to care about her and hey, stuff like that. Check this out. What? Pile of trash. Uh, yeah, an awesome pile of trash. Let's explore. You have fun, Chloe. I'm gonna go sit down. Rachel's been acting kind of standoffish ever since we left the park. What's her deal? It's because she saw her dad. That's why. I'm pretty sure that was her dad. I'm just saying. I think that was her dad. I've heard that actors are moody, but wow, Rachel. I'm not moody. I just need some space. Is that all right with you? Okay. Actually, no. I thought we were having a great day together. Why are you acting like this all of a sudden? I'm not acting like anything. I just want to be left alone right now. No, I don't understand. You can't just turn on me for no reason. I'm sorry, turn on you? I guess I forgot. It's always about how you feel, isn't it? Sad Chloe's fucking sad again. Maybe you should try giving a shit about other people for once. Are you serious right now? Fuck! <laughs> wow. Uh, okay, I still have no idea what's going on with Rachel, but... Apparently, she gets smashy when she's angry. I can work with that. Score. Hey. Check it out. I don't always drink beer, but when I do, I prefer drinking it next to an old toilet. <laughs> Home run! Can I see? Sure. I asked you to leave me alone. Are you kidding me? I, I know you're the school princess and all, with the DA daddy and the perfect grades and all the perfect little Victoria chases kissing your perfect ass. But seriously, fuck you. Great. I'm leaving. See you around, Chloe. You can't leave! Watch me. Rachel, wait! Don't go. Why not? Because, because I don't want to ruin this the way I ruin everything else in my life. And what is this exactly? Mm. I mean, fuck, are you actually going to make me say it? Say what exactly? You know, like a friendship, but more. Ah. I know. Weird, right? It's just... Today was the best day I've had since... Since my dad died. And when I almost ruined it just now, the way I ruin everything, it made me realize... Whatever's going on between us... It's one day! Come on now. It's one day! Come on. Say something. Something! Chloe, I... I... You know what? Forget it. This was really stupid. I mean, 
you're Rachel Amber, and I'm Chloe Price. It's not that. It's just hard right now. And I can't talk about it. Why not? Because I can't. I know it isn't fair, but it's how it is. Well, now. Goodbye, Chloe. Damn, they both moved fast, dude. They went through like a 20 year marriage in like an afternoon, right? GG. Let's go. Fuck this place. <laughs> All I can do is smash. Let's go. The only thing I can do is smash. Let's go. Was not working. For camera snacks. He took a million pictures of us, and not one of them showed that you were gonna leave when I needed you most. Fuck cameras. You know she's fake, yet you can't take your eyes off her. Who else do I know who fits that description? Yeah! Fuck off. That's a Rachel. pretty good hit. Let's go. If you want to rip a family apart from the inside, it's important to bring the proper tools. Fuck you, David. Oh no. <laughs> what a great card to play. Oh my god, perfect timing.
sad, man. It's really sad. Why are you crying, sweetheart? Because you're not real. <laughs> I'm not. What is going on? This is so creepy. I guess I did that. Yeah, this is a bit creepy, Kiddo. this part of it. Look on the bright side, would ya? What bright side? You made a new friend today. What's past is prologue and shit. Gotta say, that was some fight. A lover's quarrel, you might say? <laughs> she nearly took your head off. What do you care? Sorry, sweetheart. I guess I'm getting into your personal business. my marker oh there it is sometimes people need you though even when they don't admit it What the heck? How did she just happen to find her, dude? You came. I'm glad. 
Okay. I couldn't let the day end with whatever this afternoon was. Chloe, I want to talk to you about something, but I don't know how to talk about this. You don't have to tell me anything you don't want to. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? The ones who were making out? That was my dad. Oh. Told you. All right. And that woman was definitely not my mom. Oh. The worst part is... I'm not surprised. I felt like my dad's been lying about something for a while. I just... I didn't know what it was. So when I saw he got a text from an unknown number asking him to meet, I thought I, thought I could catch him or something. I'm so sorry, Rachel. I don't... I don't know what to say. Neither do I. Chloe, I love my dad. I love him. And I never want to see his fucking face again. When my dad died, I was so mad at him. For months, I felt wrong because half the time I thought of him, I wanted to scream and the other half I forgot forgot that anything had changed it's silly but I've carried this photo around with me for years it's from Mount Hood my dad took me hiking there when I was 10 and it started raining and I fell and broke my arm three miles from the car I remember screaming like I was going to die, but my dad, he carried me down the mountain. I still remember the smell of his coat and how calm he was and the sound of his voice and... He was just so strong, you know? I... I felt safe. You trusted him. Completely. Here. Chloe, I owe you an apology. Hey, we were both kind of the queen of shitty. Mm -hmm. No, I mean it. Whatever's going on between us, it's intense and new and awesome and you had the courage to tell me that you feel it too and i treated you like shit yep courage i don't know if i'd call it that or like blind desperation and maybe a slight buzz from that wine i just want you to know i'm lucky that you were with me today You're a badass, Holy Price. What? Remember that biker asshole who wouldn't let you into the mill? You talked your way right past him. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. You saw that? And those skeevy douchebags who followed you upstairs? You dropped that one guy with a bottle to the face. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Only because mm -hmm. you showed up at the last minute and... See? You're the real thing, Chloe. I don't know anyone like you. Plus, you came along with me, no questions asked. It's not true, you know me? Well, you know somebody like I don't me. really need a good reason to ditch school. I guess tomorrow they'll be held away. My mom might skip grounding and just go straight to the death penalty. And my dad mm. will definitely punish me with... Fuck your dad. Fuck him. Mm -hmm, but I would mm -hmm, give mm -hmm. to leave this place and never look back. 
What's stopping us? Us? Are you serious? There's nothing keeping me here. Not anymore. So, if I came to you tomorrow and told you to pack your bags... I'm serious. Let's do it, Chloe. Let's leave this place forever. Okay. Right? Just one day. Like, hey, I met you yesterday. Oh my god. The kids are so dumb. Can I borrow your lighter? <clears throat> Thank you. I don't think her dad was in the game, so they must, they, I don't know. I don't think her dad was in the first game. So this game's gonna be interesting. Like, I'm only one chapter in, one episode in, and I'm already extremely intrigued on where this is gonna go. Come on. Um. So live trees don't go up like that, guys. Come on now. to burn? Well, I know that. So that was the end of episode one, Awake. Let's go.